I'm a lot. I'm here. I'm here. Hello. Hello, everybody. My name is Dude, and welcome to Undertale, or rather, welcome back to Undertale. I've played this before on YouTube. And I still have not done the genocide run. Which we're not going to do tonight unless people want me to do that, but that would require, like, going back and forth and stuff. Anyway. Uh. Right, I already did the hello thing. I'm I'm more organized than I have been in previous days, so I think we're good. I think we're good. I think we're good. We are going to do the tradition the age old tradition of shoving our hand down our pants before we actually start playing the game. Just, just get it out there now. Just just get that out of your system. Uh, I'm talking about shoving your hand down your pants and saluting, not like going to jack off or something. If you want to do that, though, maybe leave the stream. Because, for now, and then come back when you're done after cleaning up and all that, and then you can hang out and stuff. Be nice. Anyway. Oh, I gotta mute the game again. Heh. <laughs> okay, that's important. So, everyone, for those of you just joining, please place one hand in your pants and salute as we listen to the stream anthem. If you're unable to do that, I cannot help you. Unfortunately. That is your own deal, and that is your own thing. <sighs> Let's try again. Ah, there we go. And the soundboard is on and ready to be played with. Well, let us begin. Uh, what is our name? Our fallen human name? My name is probably not gonna fit into that. Otherwise, I would have probably picked, like, Shake Zula, the Mike Rule, the old school you want a trip, will bring it to you. But, uh, that's not gonna happen. So, how about... B Venus Bean it Venus Our name is Venus Our name is Venus And that is how we roll Also Lutz is working again finally So yeah there's that We have a stick we have bandages we cannot mess with our items I'm disappointed. Oh yeah, look at a little penis. Look at a little penis. When this came out, I mistook it for an RPG Maker game that someone made. It was not. Holy shit, this was a trip. Alrighty. Howdy! I'm Flowey! Flowey the Flower! Oh, you're new to the underground, aren't ya? Golly, you must be so confused. Someone ought to teach you how things work around here. Guess little old me will have to do. <laughs> Ready? Here we go! The first day, the first day of the rest of your life! See that? That's your soul. The very culmination of your being. Your soul starts off weak, but can grow strong if you gain a lot of LV. What's LV stand for? Why, love, of course! You want some love, don't you? Don't worry, I'll share some with you. Wink! Mm, down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? No. Move around, get as many as you can. I don't want to. Huh. Hey, buddy, you missed them. Let's try again, okay? I don't want to. I don't want your pellets. That's nasty. Is this a joke? Are you brain dead? Run into the bullets! Friendliness pellets. You know what's going on here, don't you? Maybe I do, buddy. I see you with your little spooky face. Trying to be all intimidating. You're not that scary. You're just a little bitty flower who can shoot things. 
Everything in the underground can shoot things. I know my stuff. I've done my research. You just wanted to see me suffer. A little bit, yeah. Well, die. Well, if you insist. Oh, hey, I'm not dead. And someone burned your shit. What a terrible creature torturing such a poor, innocent youth. And I won't ever do- and I won't be doing Flowey's voice for a long time. <laughs> Shit. Maybe I should have given him a less entertaining voice than- Oh golly gee willikers! I actually like doing that voice now. <laughs> ah, do not be afraid, my child. I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to make- see if anyone has fallen down. Every day. Every day. Every day? Every day. Every day. Every day. You're the first human to come here in a long time. Then why have you been here every day? Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. If you insist. If you insist, lady. I guess I'll just keep doing Flowey's voice unasked when it's not relevant. A shadow of the ruin looms above, filling you with determination. Yay! I can heal from here. I want to read the sign. Welcome to your new home, innocent one. Allow me to educate you in the operation of the ruins. Puzzles! Okay. The ruins are full of puzzles. Ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the sight of them. Boop, boop. And the buttons have been pressed. Only the fearless may proceed. Brave ones, foolish ones, both walk not the middle road. Well, I just fucking did, boy. What are you gonna do about it? What are you gonna do about it? Boop. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. Do not worry, I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. Have you now? I can't, can I move? No, no, you want to press the other switch. I even labeled it for you. But I only want to, I want to flip the other one. I want, I want to flip the other one. What does the sign say? I forget what the signs say. Press Z to read signs, okay. Stay on the path. Bitch, what if I don't want to? What if I want to go away from the path? Both walk not the middle road. Fuck right. I wanna flip. I wanna flip the other switch, boy. I wanna flip a switch. I wanna flip this one. The switch doesn't even work. Shit. As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. How would you know? You're not a. You're not a human. Unless I believe your face is uneven. By like one pixel. Like one pixel is. It's like what? <sighs> Her head is like one pixel short on the right. I don't get it. Maybe that's how they had to make. Maybe that's how he had to make the face look to make it look decent. I don't know anymore. We need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for time. I will come to resolve the conflict. I'm just talking to the dummy. Okay, fine. If you're uh, hello? Talk. You talk to the dog. Oh, God. Hello, Kaz, how you doing? You talk to the dummy. It doesn't seem much for conversation. Ariel seems happy with you. Yay, we've earned nothing, but we've learned something. We don't have to kill anything. Can I, can I talk to the dummy? No, I can't talk to the dummy. There's another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. The true god of man does not have 
Any need for conversation? I mean, you're right. Yeah. I'd... No, we're gonna do a pacifist run. For now. We'll come back and do a genocide run of this later, I'm sure. YouTube, what do you want? Someone telling me that Hawaiian pizza is their fave, and uh, I disagree. I disagree with that notion entirely. They are wrong. I mean, you can have a favorite. You can have your favorite be Hawaiian. I will disagree with you, because I do not like Hawaiian. The western room is the eastern room's blueprint. Rungo, let, let me, let me, let me through. Sorry, I want to do this. Let me through. This is the puzzle, but. Here, take my hand for a moment. Okay, this is adorable and a little unnecessary. This is actually very unnecessary. I did not need this hand holding. Thing. I, I saw the pu I saw the path, the puzzle thing. It was given to me. Puzzles seem a little too dangerous for now. Do they? Do they? I can't even walk on these. It's fine. Spikes, too dangerous for small children. You have done excellent. Uh, you have done excellently thus far, my child. However, I have a difficult request to ask of you. I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. Oh god. Oh fuck the suspense! Oh god! How will I live without Goat Mom? Also, isn't Flowey supposed to be behind me now? Or was he behind me the entire time? I think he's just randomly behind me. I forget how that works. Well, this was easy. It's just really tense with no action. But this. Oh, I've got Fucking goddamn! <laughs> I don't need to know that. Grounded. Hello, pillar. Pillarial. I have found Toriel. Actually, can I can I get a glimpse of Flowey behind us? I still really want to find him. I, I saw him on a video once. On one of my own. Udrun finds God behind a pillar, no less. Eh. Come on, Flowey. I know you're there. Well, shit, I just went up and down twice for no reason. Shit. Alright, fine, let's get this pillow thing over with. Alright, I know you're behind the pillar, come on out. Trump comes from behind the pillar. Please God, no. Please, God, no. I don't want Trump in this game. He's the one who built the barrier, probably. Greetings, my child. Do not worry, I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillar the whole time. Oh, no wonder. I saw you there. This goat mom. It was a conveniently shaped pillar. Thank you for trusting me. However, there was an important reason for this exercise. To test your independence. You must attend to some business. You must stay alone for a while. Please remain here. It's dangerous for, to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone. If you have a need for anything, just call. Be good, alright? Okay, miss! Uh, right, I forgot we could flirt with everyone. <laughs> I forgot we could flirt with everyone. Hello. What am I fighting for? This is Toriel. I only wanted to say hello. Well then, hello. I hope that suffices. Click. I uh, will do that more later. Okay. Hello, this is Toriel. You've not left the room, have you? Oh. No, I have not left the room. And you can't prove that I- You'd run him tell- You leave- You do not tell Goat Mom 
that I left the fucking room, asshole. That is... That is tattling. You do not... She's been told. You're all fucked now. God damn it. If I go down, I'm taking you with me, Kaz. A few puzzles in the room. She's getting the belt. She doesn't have a belt. She also doesn't need a belt. She's got fire magic. I've been spared the belt. There are a few puzzles ahead that I have yet to explain. It would be dangerous to try to solve them yourself. Speaking of it, alright. You'll receive much of the belt. I will receive none of the belt. Thank you. Alright, Brad. Excuse me, human. I have some advice for you about battling monsters. Don't! The actors certainly are fight until you almost defeat them. They might not want to battle you anymore. The monster does not want to fight you. Please, use some mercy, human. Okay. It says, don't you dare touch that candy. It's for good boys only shit, fuck. I've done nothing wrong. I'm taking one. And that's all I'm taking. It says take one. What fucking what? I'm gonna take another. Wanna, wanna watch me take another? Caps lock. Oh boy. Better turn that off before the bot gets ya! I don't think the bot actually recognizes when you've done too many caps locks. I need to fix that. But yeah! I'm gonna take another! Watch me! He took more candy. How disgusting. I've got two pieces of candy. Take one. I'm taking another! You take another piece. You feel like the scum of the earth. Took too much too fast, the candy spills onto the floor. I can't move anymore. Earth come. Come. Look at what you've done. <laughs> well shit. I've at least I've got four monster candy. Which is helpful. And everyone else. It, it'll be fine, I'm sure. Hello, Froggit. Froggy didn't understand what you said, but was flattered anyway. And done. Toriel knows about that, too. It's only a matter of time before she whips out the punishment leather, aka the belt. She is not that violent. She will not spank. She does not spank. She fights on fire. Hello, this is Toriel. For no reason in particular, which do you prefer? Cinnamon or butterscotch? Butts. Do you prefer fire or belt? I would rather be lit on fire than... by Goat Mom than have Goat Mom take the belt to me. Bitch, Scotch! Oh, I see. Thank you very much. Okay. Ask about her. This is Toriel. You want to know more about me? I'm afraid there's not much to say. I'm just a silly little lady who worries too much. That's not true! Um... Am I a royalty goat? Yeah. I know. Oh, this is Toriel. You do not dislike cinnamon, do you? I know what your preference is, but... Would you turn up your nose if you found it on your plate? Only Polish tra- Only Polish trash I can eat. Oh boy. Right, right, I understand. Thank you for being patient, by the way. Ah, oh, you're fine. Three out of four gray rocks recommend you push them. Oh god, is it a rock? No. Okay. It's not a rock, thankfully. And away we go. Do I get gold from him? Yeah, I do. Rocket, he does it. He does. He does do it. Ah, shit. Okay, so I gotta not walk on the leafy part. Oh, I can already spare them. Alright, fine. What if I wanted to dance and flirt with them? That would have been a thing I would love to do. Yeah. Oh, it is the other way. Okay, for some reason I thought it, like, 
had to go in the front of it. Flirt. You wiggle your hips. Small, small wiggles back. What a meaningful conversation. Huh? Okay, we're good. Oh, that's how I get money from them. Okay. I gotta, like... Not... I gotta, like, not, uh... Just immediately spare them. Alright. Ah! Wait, no. Pop on that one. Can I flirt with them? I wanted to flirt with them. The other. And then we and then we spare both. Did you just meow? Shit. Oh well. They're fine. Whoa there, partner! Who said you could push me around? Mm -hmm. So you're asking me to move over. Okay, just for you, pumpkin. Mm hmm? You want me to move some more? Alrighty, how's this? the fuck back on your path and move. That was the wrong direction. Okay, I think I got it. Bitch! Get back over. Hmm? You want me to stay there? You're giving me a real workout. Nothing's easier when you just ask. You could also just like, I don't know. Get the hint. Jesus has been here quite a long time. It's stuck to the table. Uh oh. Yeah. Yeah. You bet that doesn't do anything. Knowing the mouse one day might leave its hole and get the cheese, it fills you with determination. That's weird. Oh, hello, ghost. Z, 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 Z. They gone yet? Z. This ghost keeps saying Z out loud repeatedly, pretending to be asleep. Move it with force? Sure. Here comes naps to bloke. This monster doesn't seem to have a sense of humor. Oh, I'm real funny. That, whoa. Stop crying, boy! It was just the check text. Naps to bloke is wishing they weren't here. Why? Give Naps the book a patient smile. Okay. Not feeling really up, up to it right now, sorry. That's a big move. I agree with that. He told Naps to book a little joke. Okay. Oh god. Ah! Ah! Shit! King seems to have improved why Naps the book's mood again. Let's do it. Naps the book wants to show you something. Let me try. I call it Dapper Bluke. You like it? it? Eagerly awaits your response. Flirt! <laughs> he looks sexy with it. He looks sexy in it. I usually come to the ruins because there's nobody around. But today I met somebody nice. Oh, I'm rambling again. I'll get out of your way. Oh, I want, I want, I want, I wanted to, I wanted to say hi. How much money do I have? Nine gold? Go to real spiders. All right, how about... Sure, we'll take a donut. We'll take a donut. And away we go. Are these guys, like, these are just tutorial things. Hello. I just realized that it had been a while since I have cleaned up. I was not expecting to have company to us. There are probably a lot of things lying, lying around here and there. You can pick them up, but do not carry more than you need. Someday you might see something you really like. You'll want to leave room in your pockets for that. Ew. I mean, I've got four pieces of candy and a donut. I'm a floor with her. <laughs> How adorable. I could pinch your cheek. You can certainly find better than an old woman like me. Bitch! Oh dear, are you serious? I do not know if this is pathetic or endearing. 
Oh, I can't do that anymore. Damn it. Okay, fine. This is Toriel. Huh? Just call me mom. Well, I suppose. Does that make you happy? To call me mother? Mother? Call me whatever you like. After flirting with her. Oh, I thought, like, if you had flirted first and then called her mom, it would have, like, weirded her out or something. In the call, I guess not. This looks harmless. It's a vegetable! Uh, dinner. You pat your stomach. Vegetoid offers a healthy meal. Eat your greens. Ow. Ah! I'm running away now. God damn it. Uh, what? Don't pick on him. Family name, Eyewalker. Please don't pick on me. Okay. I wasn't planning on picking on you. Finally, someone gets it. God, I'm horrible at dodging. Shit! Meet the candy. It'll be fine. Where's that? Faded ribbon. I'm not gonna use it because unfortunately, that was like. I would like to try and do a stick and bandage run. You know what? I don't think it matters that much. I fell down a hole. Now I can't get up. Go on without me. No, that's the book. We're in this together. I'll take you with me. Wait, ghosts can fly, can't they? Oh well. I'd still take you with me, Naps to Blue. I'll find a way to carry you. Uh, wait. Okay, there we go. That's, that's all we needed to worry about. My guess doesn't have a care in the world. Alrighty. Good. We can move on. I'm going to trigger that one carrot dude again. And get him through it. Ah. There we go. <sighs> Gives like four gold, fuck. That's some good shit right there. And that's the, uh, blueprint thing. Read this. Press the blue switch. Okay. Blue switch. You're clicking. And then everything went to shit. Give me food. Shit. Get. Did you just say fresh morning taters? It's been so long since I've had to dodge anything from these guys. I'm glad I picked up more monster candy. You can't tell me that that was a bad idea. Press the red switch. Okay. Shit! Food. Hello? 
Just between you and me. I saw Toriel come out of here just a grounded. little while ago. No, you're grounded. She was carrying some groceries. I didn't ask what they were for. We're all too intimidated to talk to her, Gribbit. You forgot to tell me, but I posted it in a public chat room. Not my fault you didn't read it. It is my fault. It is a little bit my fault you didn't read it. I should have PM'd it to you. I'm sorry. Touché. When I first played this, I thought this tree would have been a boss. Like, this whole tree would have been, like, come to life and would have been a boss or something, and it would have been awesome. That would have been cool. Elsa, how you doing, cat? How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? Watching beds. Uh, there, there. I will heal you. I should not have left you alone for so long. It was, irrespons it was irresponsible to try to surprise you like this. And, well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come, small one. Ew! Hello, tree. Every time this old tree grows any leaves, they fall right off. It also looks pretty much like a dead tree. Maybe that's why it's so black. There's no sunlight here, so it probably just, like, died out real quick. Do you smell that? Come on, sniff it! Surprise! It is a butterscotch cinnamon pie. I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here. So I will hold off on snail pie for tonight. Thanks. Thanks. I, uh... Th th thank you. That, that sounds like a lovely thing to never eat. Here, I have another surprise for you. Yes? Extra thick! No! I mean, you're not wrong. Goat mom is extra thick, but, like, don't... Sorry. For what? <laughs> the extra thick thing? <laughs> Hello, Laura. How you doing? A room of your own. I hope you like it. Aw, oh, we're getting pet pads. <laughs> Is something burning? Uh, make yourself at home. How about we go check on that pie? And see how Goat Mom's doing. Oh. Did the pie explode? Hello there, little one. The pie has not cooled down yet. Perhaps you should take a nap. I guess so. Fine. I just want to see where the, what's up with the pie. What a nice smell. Too hot to eat, though. Yeah. For some reason, there's a brand name chocolate bar in the fridge. That's good. There's some white fur stuck in the drain. The stove top is very clean. Tori almost used fire magic instead. Inside the cupboard are cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters. Like a nice place. And I'm gonna be leaving it in about five minutes. Alright. You have seen this type of plant before, but you do not know its name. I've always called them cattails. And onto the bed we go. Found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. Yay! I'm going to keep it with me. And that's how that's gonna work. Hello. I've already, I see. Um, I want you to know how happy I, how glad I am to have someone here. There's so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I've always wanted to be a teacher. You're, you seem more like the mother type than the teacher type. Maybe that kind of goes hand in hand, I don't know. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Nah, it's not. Still! I am glad to have you living here. My mother was a teacher. My mom taught Sunday school for a little bit. When can I go home? This is your home now. Um, would you like to hear about this book I'm reading? It's called 72 Uses for Snails. How about it? Exit the ruins. How about an exciting snail fact? Did you know that snails sometimes flip their digestive systems as they mature? Interesting. Yeah, but I want to know how to exit the ruins. I have to do something. Stay here. Nope. Nope. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. 
Nope, not la not letting you. Let's hold save. Before we go downstairs and into the abyss, let's go and uh, be You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. Why is it one way? I am going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. Make me! Oh, you don't stop when I access the menu. Well, shit. Mm. Let's... Yeah, let's not use any items. I'm not going to need them anyway. I have seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. Naive child. If you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you. I'm only protecting you. Do you understand? Go to your room. Make me! I'm, I'm leaving! Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. Well, fine. I don't need your stinking warnings. I want to leave so badly. <laughs> You're just like the others. There's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Fair enough. What? Oh, that's something else. Okay. I got bad at dodging, I see. Shit. I got really bad at dodging. Ah! God damn it, I saw it. Um... I don't want to use the zone yet. What are you doing? Dodge, duck, dip, dive, and dodge. I have lost the ability to do any of that. What are you proving this way? That I don't need to fight you. That's what I'm proving. Fight me or leave! Not doing either one, thank you. Too, the second you let me behind you and stuff. Damn it. Okay, now I'm playing. I know you want to go home, but... Please, go upstairs now. I promise I'll take good care of you here. Can I hug? No. Can I talk to her now, or that... We couldn't think of any conversation topics. Shit. I know we do not have much, but... Ah, nope. Nope. Not gonna fight her. We can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? Please go upstairs. Can I just hug her already? Fuck! Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single child. No, I understand. You would just be trapped, unhappy, trapped down here. The ruins are very small once you get used to them. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I'll put them aside. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. <laughs> Go on! I 
wasted all my food trying to survive you. Uh, how much do I have? I have a donut and the pie. Shit. I should go back and save. I should go back and save and I'm going to. Got real quiet here. It got real quiet there. Back to the beginning, you'll find Toriel in the front of the flowers. Yeah. Shall I? I need to go back and get spider donuts anyway. I should probably do that. Oh, wait, no, that's not where it is. Good to be well prepared. Yeah. Prepared. Prepared. What did I do? What did I do? I didn't pick on him. Typo. Oh. I just like reading typos, all right? It's not a jab at you. I got one that happened earlier today. Oh, thank car. Or thanks car. I was trying to say Thanos car. And, uh, ended up typing thanks car. That was the whole joke. It was, it was great. Loved it. Get run over on a highway. Thanks car! Okay, I have enough of cider, but I don't think it we're gonna buy donuts. Yes. And... There we go. Now all the way to the beginning. The meat Toriel. And then we'll be good. Ah. And I got nothing. Oh no! Blech. I'm dead. My leg broke. But I I sit here hobbling. Right on it. I've got a bit of pudge, I just noticed. That's a bit of pudge. I just realized those are eyes and not lungs. Un under Froggen's chest. Close their eyes. So ready for floating around that Venus was dead at the very beginning. Yeah. Probably. I wouldn't be surprised. In the slightest. I could totally debunk it in a minute. I mean... Venus could be... The first fallen child in a zombie form. Eh. Could be. Yeah, they could be. We don't know. They could be a Zambo. They could be a ghost, actually. Ghosts possess object. They could be a Thanos. They could be a thanks car. It could be a thanks car. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Oh, can we talk to the dummy? Nope. We cannot talk to the to the dummy. I'm sad. We have gone. This takes a while. <laughs> Shit.
Hate to. It's too bad it's not the Switch version. Yumi a cutie boss looks cool. That she does. Do not worry about me. Someone has to take care of these flowers. Oh, well, yeah, I did fall on them and stuff. I worry about you and I want to hug you again. Eh, whatever. I'm sure someone will mod the, the Mew Mew boss fight into the game. Someday. Derp. Or they'll make it available on Unitail. If that is still a community. There's been a hacking group trying to get the Dog Shrine. Apparently the Dog Shrine's already in the game, they just don't have it accessible or something. At least that's what I saw. Yeah. Like the map is in the files. It's just not a thing you can access. It is, but isn't. Yup. It's in the game, rather in the programming, but that's it. Is that up for Xbox? Now that I think about it. PS4. PS4 and Switch. If there's any other secret shit to add, then, uh, I guess it would be on an Xbox version. There was that little clip. So, Xbox would be perfect, yeah. What was that one clip of the, uh, clam lady turning into a gaster follower? I saw it. No, right? I have a theory on it. Do you now? I would love to hear it. Oh, shit. Actually, multiple theories. Do tell. Got a lot of time before I get to the end of this of the ruins again. Uh, all to see Goat Mom one last time. And get a little bit of gold on my way over because you don't get much gold in a pacifist run. Need check grains. As the gaster's influence is growing stronger, turning monsters into core followers, the more time gets messed with. Kinda sucks that nothing new is in, like, the PC version, though. But I guess they gotta add something exclusive to the console versions, otherwise all the versions will be the same and nothing will be interesting. Not that I can see. Yeah. Alrighty, down this long hallway we go. Sup, bitch? Ready to meet your best friend? Clever. Very clever. You think you're really smart, don't you? In this world, it's kill and be killed. You were able to play by your own rules. You spared the life of a single person. And everything else I encountered down there. <laughs> I bet you feel really great. You didn't kill anybody this time. But what will you do if you meet a relentless killer? Not kill them. 
You'll die and you'll die and you'll die until you tire of trying. What will you do then? Will you kill out of frustration? Or will you give up entirely on this world and let me inherit the power to control it? I'm the prince of this world's future. Don't worry, my little monarch. My plan is a regicide. It's so much, this is so much more interesting. <laughs> if I, if you say so, boy. Eh. Bitch. One, two, three, let's go! Thank you for that. <sighs> Dab. Huh? There's a camera heading in the bushes. Shit. Someone's watching me. I always feel like somebody's watching me. And I get no privacy. Wah. <laughs> Oh shit. I always feel like somebody's watching me. <laughs> ah. You can say this place really chills you down to the bones. <sighs> yep. Yep. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. <laughs> the old whoopee cushion and the hand trick. It's always funny. Anyways, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans. Sans the skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now, but, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now my brother Papyrus, he's a human haunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Let's go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My brother made the bars too wide to stop anyone. Alright, fine. Ah. Don't push me with the skeletal bone, but. It's not cool. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. Alright. Well, this is conveniently shaped. What's up, bro? You know what's up, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles! Just hang around outside your station! What are you even doing? Masturbating? Stare at this lamp. It's, pretty co it's really cool. You wanna take a look? No, I don't have time for that! Every human comes through here! I want to be ready! I will be the one! I must be the one! I will capture a human! Then I, the Great Papyrus, will get all the things I utterly deserve. Respect, recognition, I will finally be able to join the Royal Guard. You will ask to be my friend? I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning. Um, this lamp will help you. Sans, you are not helping, lazy bones. All you do is sit and boondoggle. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. You got a ton of work done today. A skeleton. Sands. The situation looks very grave. Smiling. I am and I hate it. 
someone as great as me to put up, have to do so much to get some recognition. Oh, sounds like you're really working yourself down to the bone. Ugh. I will attend to my puzzles. As for y'all, black, put a little more backbone into it. <laughs> All right, you're grounded. Where's my grounded sound? Oh, here we go. Grounded! There we go. I forgot I had it at the very bottom. Okay, you can come out now. All right, then. You wanna get going. He might come back. And if he does, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. Hang Just a conveniently shaped lamp. It's some sort of checkpoint or sentry station. But there are bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting inside. Alrighty. Actually, hey, to bother you, but can you do me a favor? Sure. I was thinking, my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before. And seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries to be. Thanks a million. I'll be up ahead. But you you went you went this way. You went this way. Too bad Venus has no body to love. I promise. I don't believe- I don't entirely believe that statement. I don't entirely believe that statement. I don't have the stomach for it. That, that's still kind of a pun because he's a scout. Think about ice pun. I've heard that one. Ah, shit. Okay, for reals. Uh... Oh! Okay, I'm supposed to laugh that. Okay, whoa. Ice puns, you say? No. 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 Don't you dare. Don't you dare. It's a fishing rod affixed to the ground. Reel it in? Sure. All that's attached to the end of a photo is a weird looking monster. Call me, here's my number. You decided not to call. Good. What's I was saying about Hundine? I can't seem to recall one, though. Well, uh, that's cold. Must have slipped my mind. Can't help me. Laura's making puns. And they're all bad. Uh, Sans? Oh my god, is that a human? Uh, actually, I think that's a rock. Yeah. It was that in front of a rock. It really shattered my heart. Time to igloo it back together. Cat, no! Cat, no. Cat, no! <laughs> Put up with enough of it at work, please stop. <laughs> please stop. God damn. I'm ending the stream. 
I'm ending the stream. Not really. Not really. I'm not ending the stream for that. <laughs> but, like, I'm considering it briefly. I can put you in private messages. What have, I, what, have, what have I done? Kat, did you want me to play this just so you'd have an excuse to make puns? I wonder. Is that why I was told not to not... Is that why I was not told to not play Undertale? <laughs> eh. Discord, go away. Oh my god. Is, is that a human? Yes. Oh my god! Sans, I finally did it! And then I'm gonna... I'll be so... Popular! Popular, popular! Ahem. Human? You shall not pass this area. I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you. Stop that now! I got a wing out of this very entertaining. You're stretching now. That was an excellent way to... You are grounded. They will then capture you. You'll be delivered to the capital. And then... I'm not sure what comes next. In any case, continue. Only if you dare. <laughs> Stop that now. I really like your papyrus voice, though. Thank you. Thank you, human. Well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep a nice suck it up for you. At least you went the right way for once. Oh, Ice Cap. Um. Oh, boy. Inform Ice Cap that it has a great hat. Envious? Too bad. Oh, boy. Nice Baron. Nope. Managed to tear your eyes away from Ice Cap's hat. Looks like he got you ice. I'm never playing Undertale again. I'm never playing Undertale again after today. I don't have anything to drink near me, so I can't make that joke. I probably shouldn't be drinking anything. It looks annoyed. Uh. If you ate puns now, just wait for June. Oh god. Seems defeated. Fine, I don't care. You're still attacking me though. Okay. Uh. Absolutely no moving. Something move? Was it my imagination? You can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never moves again. Why do you sound like McCree? That wasn't McCree. <laughs> that wasn't McCree. Excited by movement. Hobbies include squirrels. Don't move an inch. Man. Pet doggo. Look, I've been pet. It actually, really does mean to remain motionless. He looks so sad that something unknown pet him. Something pet me. Something that isn't moving. I'm gonna need some dog treats for this. Hello. Hello? Anybody there? Ooh. Oh, I can... I can ring the bell. Are you two playing a trick on me? Real funny. 
Hey, is that you? Come on. Well, it's not the tall skeleton. He's too loud. Cat. Cat. No. Whoever you are, knock it off. I like puns. I can tell. Someone's been smoking dog treats. Oh, hello. They get me. Oh! What's coming out of your mouth now? Or is there more to that? Why do I have four messages on Discord? Oh. Well, that's Hobo saying something. Excited and elated. <sighs> Looks so disappointed. I am disappointed. Okay, never playing Undertale again after today. Thank you. <laughs> See a blue attack, don't move and it won't hurt. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. If you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so imagine a blue stop sign instead. Simple, right? For fighting, think about blue stop signs. Oh, I hope it was. North ice, south ice, west ice. East Snowden and Ice. Ice, Ice, Bobby. Hello, I am a snowman. I want to see the world, but I cannot move. If you would be so kind, Traveler, please take a piece of me and bring it very far away. Sure. You got the snowman piece. Okay. Eat it in front of him. No! That's rude. You're so lazy! You were napping all night! I think that's called sleeping. Excuses, excuses! Oh! The human arrives! In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles! I think you will find this one quite shocking! But you see, this is the invisible electricity maze! When you touch the walls of this maze, this orb will administer a hearty zap! Sounds like fun, because the amount of fun you will probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go forward now. <laughs> Sans, what did you do? I think the human has to hold the orb. Oh, okay. Hold this, please. Uh. Okay, try now. Ow. I can go forward quite far without getting hit. Incredible! You slippery snail! Slip it so easily. Too easily! Mm. However, the next puzzle will not be easy. It was designed by my brother, Sans! He will surely be confounded! I know I am. <laughs> Did he just... He just... He, he didn't walk. He just, like, moonwalked away. He just, like, moonwalked this way. Hi, Sans. Hey, thanks. Your brother seems to 
Seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? He made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything ever since. He hasn't worn anything else ever since. He keeps calling it his battle body. Man, is my brother cool? Yes. Your brother's amazing. Hello. I don't understand why these aren't selling. It's the perfect weather for something cold. No, it's not. Oh, a customer! Would you like some nice cream? Mmm. Fifteen gold, sure. Here you go, have a super duper day. Not the ice cream. Yay. Plus 15, instead of a joke, the rapper says something nice. Imagine the ice cream man having a voice like Matt Pat. Nice cream? It's the frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just 15 gold. Here you go. Have a super duper day. But that's just a theory. <laughs> Shit. A game theory. I can't get it down. There we go. Uh. There we go. Even when you felt trapped, you took notes and achieved the end of ball. Or awarded two gold. Yay. It looks like a snowball. Actually, it's a snow decahedron. It took me a while. It took me a long time to get all the flags. I have not gotten all the flags yet. I've been thinking about selling treats too. Want some fried snow? It's just five gold. Sure. When I say five gold, I meant fifty gold. Really? How about five thousand gold? Fifty thousand gold. It's my final offer. What? You don't have the money? Yeah, that's okay. I don't have any snow. Oh, shit. Is hers smell danger rating? Snow smell, snowman, white rating can become yellow rating. Suspicious smell, puppy, blue rating. Smell of rolling around, weird smell, humans, green rating, destroy at all costs. I like how they, s I like, I like the yellow snow reference. Dead doggos. Human? I hope you're ready for. Sans, where's the puzzle? Best dog of yeah. It's right there on the ground. There's no way they can get past this one. Um. I mean, I solved it before. With the exception of the bottom one. Or the top one. Gas of blah 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 blah. I didn't do anything! I don't know, guys. This is a real tricky one. <laughs> Whoops. I know I should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that! In my opinion, Junior Jumble is easily the hardest. What? Really, dude? That easy-peasy word scramble? It's for baby bones. Unbelievable. Human, solve this dispute! Which is harder? Jumble. Ha! <laughs> ah! Yes! Humans must be very intelligent. They're also... They also find Junior Jumble so difficult. <laughs> Jumble? No crossword! I... I don't... I don't know. I was saying Junior Jumble just to appease my brother. Yesterday I got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. Hey. A note from Papyrus. Human, please enjoy the spaghetti. No, the spaghetti is a trap. Designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize that you aren't progressing. Thoroughly japed again by the great Papyrus. <laughs> Papyrus. Homestuck reference. Uh, I, I've not read too much Homestuck. A plate of frozen spaghetti. It's so cold it's stuck to the table. It's an unplugged microwave. All of the settings say spaghetti. But it's unplugged. Hello, mouse. Hello, lethal mouse. Warning, dog marriage. 
Uh-oh. Apparently lifted your hand and lesser dog got excited. You lightly touch the dog. It's already overexcited. Oh, shit. You pet the dog, it raises the set up to beat your hand. <laughs> it was like a dog. Excited noises. Excitement knows no bounds. Pet, 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 pet. Critical pet. Dog excitement increased. You have to jump up to meet the pet the dog. You don't even pet it, it gets more excited. Plane take off. There's no way to stop this madness. Kettle with some places. The dog enters the realm of the clouds. You call the dog, but it is too late. It cannot hear you. <laughs> it's coming back down. You can reach lesser dog again. Oh, thank you. I'm patting him. Hardcore. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god, I love this game. Me too, Nickel. Me too. How you doing, by the way? It's Doggo. It's possible that you may have a problem. Spam pet. I am doing exactly that. I have no problems. <laughs> He's now the speech bubble. He is now the speech bubble. <laughs> the good dog, Brent. Petting increase. Be the speech bubble! <laughs> I actually need to heal now that I think about it. Oh, I'm going to. I'm gonna pet him. Pet! Petting level is increased by 50. <laughs> No stopping this dog. There will be no stopping of this dog. Only pet. He's about to reach the. He's got a little bit behind the screen. The menu. He's almost come. He's unpetable, but it appreciates the attempt. Ah. At least he appreciates the attempt. The attempt. I'm gonna keep going until he's below the uh, below the main menu again. We can still pet his neck. I'm sure. He's about to be gone. He's about to be gone, indeed. More petting needs to happen. Be gone, dog. Crossing over to reach the truth gate. There we go. He's peeking out. Perhaps mankind was not meant to pet this much. What secrets will he find? It continues. None. It continues. It continues. Some dog is questioning your choices. <laughs> there are no secrets in the universe. There's a lot of secrets. Oh shit. I will not stop. Can he loop back around? Lesser dog is beyond your reach. Can't stop. Really? Really? Unless the dog is gone where no dog has gone before. <laughs> Wish there was a bubble that said just fucking stop.
I think we're about done. 60 gold. 60 gold. Shit, my dude. Ah. There's a switch hidden in the snow. Click. The pets were too good. They were too strong. The snow has moved. That map is kind of useless now. Yeah. What's that smell? Where's that smell? Your smell? Identify your smell! Oh no! They have found the smell. Hmm. Here's that weird smell. Makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you! Uh. We're here all around. All in the dirt and snow. You smell like a weird puppy. Let's kick human tail! Uh. Shit. Dog sniff you again. After rolling in the dirt, you smell alright. What? Smells like a. Eh. Lux thinks that you may be a lost puppy. Pet. Pet the dog or Asa. Dogs that. Dogs that pets dogs. I'll pet you in a second there, Dogga. Dogarasa. Whatever your name was. Dogami. Don't leave me out. I'm not going to. I just have to get to both of you. Yeah, yeah. We go. Pet all the dogs. I will do just that. Dogs can pet other dogs. A new world has, been, has opened up for us. Thanks, weird puppy. He thinks they're about to commit some kind of fetish art. Fetish thing. Yeah. Oop. It's a weird looking puppy. What? How did you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? Uh. You'd think, but it never happened. Really? Wowie. You resisted the flavor of my home cooked pasta. Just so you could share it with me? Yes, that is exactly what I did. Fret not, human. I, Master Chef Papyrus, will make you all the pasta you could ever want. <laughs> yeah. He did it backwards. He did it backwards. My brother started a sock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. <laughs> Papyrus defies all logic of space. Human! How do I say this? It was taking a long time to arrive, so... I decided to improve this puzzle by sponsoring myself with rogue energy. <laughs> I signed a deal with rogue energy and now I'm sponsored by them. I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face. Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. Now the solution is different. And as usual, my lazy brother is now around. I suppose what I'm saying is... Worry not, human! I, the Great Papyrus, will solve this conundrum. Then we shall both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try the puzzle yourself. I'll try not to give the away the answer. Okay, let's see if I remember how to do this. care about puzzles like I do. Well, I'm sure you'll love them. The next puzzle, then. It might even be too easy for you. <laughs> Turn every accent to an L, then press the switch, okay? That's already done. 
Oh, hey, buddy. Thought, sa thought Papyrus couldn't fight you. The job on solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help. Which is great, because I love doing absolutely nothing. You say so, buddy. Sure is pup. Cat, no. Cat, no. Cat, no. Thing to say, but it's not something I can say in public, so I should probably just PM it to you. <laughs> Next pun. Human! Oh, Sans, it's the human! I'm gonna love this puzzle! It was made by the great Dr. Elfies! You see these tiles? Once I throw this switch. Cat, yeah, don't interrupt someone working intently on a puzzle. <laughs> Mm. Excuse me. Yes, sorry, you'll hear some crosswords. Is that Metaton next to Papyrus? No. Nah, it's not Metaton. They'll begin to change color! Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric. They will electrocute you. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you will have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They'll make you smell delicious! Blue tiles are water tiles. So it through if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery. We'll slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soap it smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How is that? Understand? Sure. Great! And there's one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random! When I pull this switch, it'll make a puzzle that has never been seen before. Not even I know the solution. <laughs> Get ready. Oh boy. Here it comes! <laughs> Cranked. The machine isn't working. Oh. Actually, that spaghetti from earlier it wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking lessons, he's been improving a lot. But if he keeps this up, next year he'll even make something edible. Ah. Oh god, it's the dog thing! <laughs> Seems like the base of a snow dog. It's the broken head of a snow dog. <laughs> Get jabated. It's the broken head of a snow dog. Oh god. The massacre. On the floor inside is a box of pommel raisins. Aware of dog, please pet dog. The dog just rushed in here, filled with inspiration. It kept trying to build a snow dog that expressed his own emotions. But as it built, it kept getting more excited about the sculpture. Its neck got longer and longer, and it added more and more snow until... It was rather sad to watch, but I couldn't turn away. I am the snow dog. Knowing the dog will never give up trying to make the perfect snow dog, it fills you with determination. Sorry, I had to send a quick text. Oh boy. Eh. Nobody gives a shit about your determination, Frisk. I do. I care how determined Frisk is. Her name's not even Frisk, it's Venus. I had to think for a second. Is there something south of it? Oh, Venus. Venus crunch, Venus crunch. Beat him up, beat him up, beat him up. Ooh, hello. It's a snow papyrus. 
It's a lump of snow with the word Sans written on it in red marker. Alright. Sans is sponsored by Lutz, apparently. Oh, shit. I'm going to expire piss from my Venus, so beer be Speed run! Oh my god, there was a snow dog on my head. Aww. What's up? What? Are you lost? Apparently. Undecorate. Remove the barbed wire made of pipe cleaners. I don't want to decorate him. He's got a. He's... What? Ah! I don't want to decorate him. He's got a long. He's got a hard life ahead of him. That's a little better. He's got a hard life. He doesn't need to be decorated. as I use this tiny cane to walk on it. The weight has been lifted. No trust problems have been taken away. See? He didn't need that. Can I go back to- Aha! Are you sure you'll do like the exercise? Are you lost? Apparently. Hello, door. We can't actually go in here. But like, yeah. It's a door. Yeah, it is a door. And I've not been able to open this door before, so, yeah. Until you dodge all the credits. Yeah, I'm not in any... I'm not good enough to do that. Hey, are you following me? Maybe, are you following me? Sure do like to exercise. I think he's following me, guys. It's a snow puff. And this is a snow puff. It's poopy. This, however, is a snow puff. Surprisingly, it's a snow puff. Snow puff. Is it really a snow puff? Behold! A snow puff. Eh? There's 30 gold inside this. What is this? A snow puff. Snow puff, bitches. What a tiny doghouse. Woof. Hello, snow puff. Oh. It's got a tail. Oh, <laughs> it pupper. It pupper. Oh. Oh. It's the greater dog. Uh Beckon, you call the greater dog. It bounds towards you, flecking slobber into your face. Oh god. Stop barking! It hurts. Gets so comfortable it falls asleep. Then it wakes up. It's so excited! It Greater dog's excitement is creating a power field that prevents fa petting. Why does its spear have a face? Why wouldn't its spear have a face? Uh, play. They make a snowball and throw it for the dog to fetch. It splats on the ground. Greater dog picks up all the snow in the area and brings it to you. <laughs> now dog is very tired. It rests its head on you. Aww. My pet. As you pet the dog, it sinks its entire weight into you. Your movement's slow, but you still haven't pet enough. I will continue petting. You pet decisively. Pet capacity reaches 100%. The dog flops over with its legs hanging in the air. Aww. Ow. Oh good, we can spare him now. Maybe he wants a face on that spear. We pet the dog. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> He's piloting the armor. I just great HP with max up. Yay. 
need to get those bicycles. It's like the two pronged ice cream bar. Human! This is your final and most dangerous puzzle! Challenge! Challenge, I can read, I swear. Behold! The Gauntlet of Deadly Terror! <laughs> oh, the oh god, the horror. When I say the word, it will fully activate! Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, blades will slice! Each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it! Oh, look, a dog. <laughs> oh, what's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm, I'm about to activate it now! That uh, doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge, it, it seems maybe too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, I can't use this one. I am a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair. My traps are expertly cooked. But this method is too direct. No class at all. Away it goes. I don't want to pet the doggo. Phew. What are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus. end of the other side of the bridge. Okay. The flowery thing? Ha ha! Ha ha! Ha! Found him. He sometimes just appears behind you randomly. I guess that's one of the more common places. I don't know what my brother's gonna do now. If I were you, I'd make sure I understand blue attacks. Of secrets on this game. Same. Same boy. Uh, right, I only need a one donut. Hello, traveler. How can I help you? Now come again sometime. I've bought all the all the bicycles. All of them. That'll do for now. The sight of such a friendly town fills me with determination. Yes, it does. Hello, welcome to Snowden. Snowden's premier hotel. One night is eighty gold. Sure. Here's your room key. Make sure you to bundle up. Hiya, you look like you had a great sleep. Which is incredible, because you were only up there for about two minutes. Here's your money back. You can pay me if you're going to stay overnight. Alright, we've got more than uh, 20 health now. Yay. I thought there was supposed to be a song or something. That played when you let them snore enough or something. That lady over there. Something about her disturbs me. Isn't my little cinnamon just the cutest? Bun buns are so adorable. <laughs> Waited a little longer it'll play. I thought I I thought I couldn't leave until it finished playing. Awful teens tormented a local monster by decorating its tree like horns. So we started giving that monster presents to make it feel better. Now it's a tradition to put presents underneath a decorated tree. I don't get it. Carefully decorated tree. Some of the presents are addressed from Santa to various locals. Things were just having fun. Yeah, but they, they were harming somebody, which is not fun. Yo, you're a kid too, right? I can tell because you're wearing a striped shirt. Is that a thing? It's, it's, it's okay, Laura. It's just like, the, the, as long as the, if the fun hurts people, then it's not fun. This town doesn't have a mayor. But if there's ever a problem, a skeleton will tell a fish lady about it. That's politics! 
also a bar. No matter where I go, it's the same menu, the same people. Help. I want new drinks and <laughs> hot guys. Hey, isn't human food different from monster food? It does things like spoil. When you eat it, it passes all the way through your whole body. Disgusting. I'd love to try it sometime. I recommend a few recipes for you. Better watch where you sit down here, kid. Because that big guy will jump into your lap and give you lots of love and attention. For centuries. We never get any respect. I wish the skeletons would throw us a bone. We love bones. Oh, I'm sure you do. Huh? <laughs> Good dog! I pet him. I'm eager to get in the spike collar to show off my personality. It makes a statement like, Attach a leash to me and take me for a walk, please. I mean, you're a dog, so I would probably do that. If you want. Just saying. Playing poker against itself. It appears to be losing. Oh no. Those dogs are part of the Royal Guard, the elite military group led by Undyne. She's rude, loud, and beats up everybody who gets in her way. It's no wonder all the kids want to be like her when they grow up. I put out a line for some girls today. Someone told me that there are plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm taking that seriously. I'm literally going to make out with a fish. Catfishing. No. Do not want... The capital's getting pretty crowded, so I've heard they're going to start moving here. Hmm. I don't want to see the erasure of lo our local culture, but I definitely want to see some city slickers slip onto their butts. Oh. The jukebox is broken. Aw. Rob said that he'd offer you a glass of water, but he doesn't touch the stuff. Well, alright then. Everyone is always laughing and cracking jokes, trying to forget our modern crises. Dreariness, crowding, lack of sunlight. I would join them, but I'm just not very funny. Oh. We all know the underground has problems, but we smile anyway. Why? We can't do anything, so why be morose about it? I mean, you could try to do something, for sure play monsters and humans. You aren't gonna make me be the human again, are you? Ah, to be young again. The world sure felt boundless. Ah, what a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. Ah, my patience rewards me. Are they getting off to this? I I'm going to leave now. Yeah, here, here's this doggo throwing ice into the, uh, into the river or something. Huh? Ring, ring. Hello, can I speak to G? Wait a second. Is this the wrong number? It's the wrong number! The wrong number song! We're very, very sorry that we got it wrong! No, it's the wrong number! The wrong number song! We're very, very sorry that we got it wrong! I didn't think that would happen, but I'm glad it did. <laughs> I was thinking about that song the whole day, the whole like few hours before stream. I decided to stream Undertale. Random chance, bless you. Yes. Hello. <coughs> when I was younger, my teachers gave me word searches when they ran out of assignments. I thought they were a waste of time, but look at me now. I'm the number one word search creator in the entire underground. Probably because you're the only one who makes them anymore. That look in your eye. You're someone that has difficulty solving Junior Jumble, aren't you? Maybe. I love working on the newspaper. There's so little to report that we just fill it with comics and games. Oh my god, I love that. Here I am, writing this book. The person comes in and picks up the book. They, stare re they start reading it. Oh, sorry, I'm still writing that one. Monsters are mostly made of magic, human beings are mostly made of water. Humans, with their physical forms, are far stronger than us. 
They will never know the joy of expressing themselves through magic. They'll never get a bullet pattern birthday card. Ah. Uh, there's a school report about monster funerals. Monster funerals, technically speaking, are cool as heck. When monsters get old and kick the bucket, they turn into dust. At funerals, we take that dust and spread it on that person's favorite thing. Then their essence will live on in that thing. Uh, am I at the page minimum yet? I'm kind of sick of writing this. Big mood. If they're made of magic, monsters' bodies are immune, attuned to their soul. If the monster doesn't want to fight, its defenses will weaken. And the crueler the intentions of our enemies, the more their attacks will hurt us. Therefore, if a being with a powerful soul struck with the desire to kill, uh, that's in the chapter here. They would kill the monster. Monster History Part 4. Fearing the humans no longer, we moved out, out of our old city home. We braved harsh, cold, damp swampland and searing heat until we reached what we now call our capital, New Home. Again, our king is really bad at names. Love, hope, compassion. This is what people say monster souls are made of. But the absolute nature of soul is unknown. After all, humans have proven their souls don't need these things to exist. And... What's the book? Ouch. Eh. Welcome to the library. Yes, we know, the sign is misspelled. This is Librarby. Or they got the sign from Arby's. The box is labeled Papyrus. Look inside? Sure. It's empty. The mailbox is overflowing with unread junk mail. It's locked. There's a door behind there. Um... Let's go save real quick. I don't need to. I want to. Probably gonna... Need like one more... One more bicycle from uh, the, the bunny lady before this fight happens. Eh. Have you lost to Papyrus? No. I mean, not intentionally, not that I know of. Not in this run, anyway, obviously. I ha oh, yeah, I have lost to Papyrus. He sends you to the his, uh, garage over and over. Allow me to tell you about some complex feelings. Feelings like the joy of finding another pasta lover. The admiration for another's puzzle-solving skills. The desire to have a cool, smart person think you're cool. These feelings, they must be what you are feeling right now. You can hardly imagine what it must be like to feel that way. After all, I am very great. I don't even wonder what having friends is, lots of friends is like. I pity you, lonely human. Worry not! You shall be lonely no longer. I, the Great Papyrus, will be your... No. If this is all wrong, I can't be your friend. You're a human! I must capture you! Then I can fulfill my lifelong dream. Powerful, popular, prestigious! That's Papyrus, the newest member of the Royal Guard! What? You're flirting? Do you finally reveal your ultimate feelings? Well, I'm a skeleton with very high standards. I have zero redeeming qualities. I can make spaghetti. I can make spaghetti. That is a thing I know how to do. Though I don't know how to make the sauce. Both of these. You're correct. I don't have any redeeming qualities, but I can make spaghetti. Oh no! You're meeting all my standards! <laughs> I guess this means I have to go on a date with you? Let's date later, after I capture you. There's this thing about what to wear for his date. So you won't fight. Then let's see if you can handle my fabled blue attack. Ah. Uh. Uh. You're blue now. That's my attack. 
<laughs> oh god, you're blue now. Hmm. What about I should wear? Ow. Oh, it's up. It's up, not the A button. Okay. You're looking a little blue. Oh my fucking god. Skipped over that. Help, I can help. Oh, up longer than jump higher. Jeez. And there we go. Yeah, don't make me use my special attack. Future popularity. Oh, shit. Ah, fuck. Iris, head of the royal guard. I need to get good at dodging, so I'm actually gonna try to dodge. Papyrus. Unparalleled Spaghetti! What? Spaghetti? Spaghetti. That's not a word. That's not a- that's not a- that's not a word. And I'll be really proud of me! <laughs> the king will trim a hedge in the shape of my smile! <laughs> my brother will- he won't change very much. No, he will not. No. Nice watching. I had fun, but I'm getting super sleepy. That's fine. Go to bed. I'll have lots of admirers, but... Good night. Uh. 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 Oh, shit. I don't like me as sincerely as you. He was really rare. Uh, shit. Uh, I think it might be kind of hard. Well, you know what else is gonna be hard, Papyrus? I know what else is gonna be hard. Oh, right. We'll be captured and stuff, and it won't be as easy to, like, okay. uh, Who cares? Give up! No. Make me slut. Give up my my special attack! I don't wanna give up. Ah! Yeah, very soon I will use my special attack. Not doing you too good here. Not too long, and I will use that special attack. Shit. Uh, your last chance before my special attack. Uh, so much easier if the button was back. The jump button was a button and not a directional key. Behold! My special attack! Aw. The heck? It's my special attack! You stupid dog! Do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone! What are you doing? Come back here with my special attack! Oh well. This is a really cool regular attack. Here's an absolutely normal attack. Oh god. Uh, 
shit. Shit. Ah, uh. uh. oh, fuck. Ah, uh, am I screwed? Kind of. Not really. Oh, boy. I made it. I made it. Did I make it? Am I fine? Well, I... It's clear you can't defeat me. Yeah! I can see you shaking your boots. Therefore I, the Great Papyrus, elect to grant you pity. I will spare you, human. Now's your chance to accept my mercy. Uh, finally. <laughs> I sucked more than I thought I would. No! <laughs> I can't even stop someone as weak as you! Undyne's going to be disappointed in me. I will never join the Royal Guard and... My friend Quantity remains stagnant! Let's be friends. What a loser. Let's be friends. Really? You want to be friends with me? Well then, I guess... I guess I can make an allowance for you. Wowie! We haven't even had our first date, and I've already managed to hit the friend zone! <laughs> Who knew that all I needed to make pals was to give people awful puzzles and then fight them? You taught me a lot, human. I hereby grant you permission to pass through, and I'll give you directions to the surface. Continue forward until you reach the end of the cavern. Then, when you reach the capital, cross the barrier. That's the magical seal trapping us all underground. Anything can enter through it, but nothing can exit. Except someone with a powerful soul. Like you! That's why the king wants to acquire a human. He wants to open the barrier with soul power. Then us monsters can return to the surface. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. To reach the exit, you will have to pass through the king's castle. The king of all monsters. He is... Well, he's a big fuzzy pushover. Everybody loves that guy. I'm certain if you just say, Excuse me, Mr. Dreamer, can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and ha have that date. <laughs> Papyrus. Away! I need to save now. <laughs> Badly. I'm also at three health, which is a bad thing. Uh, can I go in here? Please don't enter the mysterious shack. But I want to enter the mysterious shack. He came back to have that date with me. You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special. A place I like to spend a lot of time. Where is that? Where are we going, I wonder? Oh. My house! <laughs> okay, if you insist. Impressed. I increase the height of my sink. Now I can fit more bones under it. Take a look-see. There's a doggo. What? Catch that meddling canine! Curses. <laughs> Sans, stop plaguing my life with incidental music. Can I go in here? Forget it. Aw. I wanted to go in. I need to save first. I need to save first. It's about time to end the stream anyway. And I'm also, like, at free health. I think the date would go on for quite a while. Eh. Why did I not go through the igloo? I'm an idiot. Also, I should probably stock up on some bicycles. There we go. Bye now, come again sometime. Will do. But if such a friendly town fills you with determination yet again, I'm going to end the stream here. Uh, thank you guys so much for coming by. Hope you enjoyed. This will go live on YouTube again sometime in the next couple days. Uh, I do intend to do a genocide run after the pacifist run. 
So just kind of like tune in for that on Mixer or Twitch, wherever this happens to be. Probably Mixer only. I don't know. I'm doing Hearts and Heroes on Twitch exclusively anyway, so I guess that makes sense. It's whatever. Anyway, thank you guys so much for coming by, and I will see you guys next time. And thank you to Shron Labiel for supporting me on Patreon, and thank you to Whirly Bird and Zorito Burrito for supporting me on Twitch. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye!